Hey, Peter Searcy with Community and Council Realty. You know, Atlanta is a huge college football town. You're in the heart of SEC country, you've got fans of Georgia and Georgia Tech, but because Atlanta is such a destination for people moving here from other cities, you've got fans of college football teams from all over. Now, we can't all agree on the same team, but we can agree on good food. So if you get invited to a tailgate party, don't show up empty handed. We're gonna stop by Chef Dave's house and he's gonna show us how to make some things that'll knock the socks off your friends. Let's go check on Chef Dave. What's up, Chef Dave? Oh, hey, Peter. <laughs> how are you, man? Getting ready to grill the world's best wings. All right, well, good to see you, man. Good to see you, buddy. Thank you for doing this. Everybody enjoyed the uh, Super Bowl dips video we did earlier in the year. Heck yeah. So what do we have today? Well, we're gonna grill uh, some wings with some charcoal. Nice, nice. It doesn't always have to be charcoal, but you know, we got good charcoal here and I like the flavor of wood on chicken, okay. on anything really, yeah. vegetables, meat uh, of all kinds. So uh, it's real important that we get it nice and hot so that we can get some nice good sear on that chicken wing. So, <laughs> well, I'm excited. Let's get to it. All right. I took all my spices and I actually toasted them. I toasted them on the grill here. And then what I'm going to do is I'm just going to simply put my measured spices that I already measured out. And then I actually took some shallot, some garlic, some olive oil, some lemon juice. And then I took it and put it in the blender and I made a puree out of it. I'm just going to add some zest because I really want that lemon flavor to pop but I don't want as much lemon juice in there to make that flavor. Another thing I do that's not on the recipe actually, is when I'm doing stuff that's in a grill, especially a wood grill, I actually am using smoked salt right here. And I actually, this is black pepper that's been smoked as well. So now I'm gonna take these wings, I'm gonna put the marinade in there important that all the flavor surrounds all those wings. All right, Peter, you want to help me? All right, all right Dave, I'm, I'm back here to we help you here. We've got some awesome wings that have been marinating for a little while. I'm actually going to add some bourbon soaked wood chips and some, a little bit of apple as well. Okay. So it'll give it a little bit more of that wood flavor in there. Okay. As a chef, I feel highly qualified to hold this for you. <laughs> <laughs> Thank so you. All right, so while the chicken's grilling here, uh, I'm gonna make a quick blue cheese dip. Uh, I call it the dip. These are like little things that I would do personally at home to make a blue cheese dip. I would use nice fresh chives as an example. So I got a little bit of zest on there and I'm actually gonna put a little bit of lemon juice. So I'm just gonna take the same lemon, squeeze that lemon juice in there. I'm a big fan of a uh, blue cheese called Maytag. That's what this is right here. I'm going to put a little bit of buttermilk in there. The recipe you guys have, there's some measurements for this as well. I'm in the south, you know I'm going to use some Duke's mayo. And the last ingredient is sour cream. So I got some sour cream that I'm going to put in here as well. And then it'll be ready. And that is a little salt and pepper. I'm going to use that same smoked salt that I used earlier. A whole bunch of black pepper. And if you don't like blue cheese, you can omit that and basically you kind of have like a, uh, a quasi ranch in here too. I'm gonna actually pour this back in here for later on and then we'll be all set. All right guys, let's see. Whoa. Those chicken are looking like they're doing pretty good in there. Oh man. So I gotta start turning them a little bit. So see, I'm getting the color on there that I want. That's the color I want right there. So I'm just gonna go ahead and close that lid. Yeah, that's that's what we want right there. We're hitting 190. So these are almost ready. Or are they ready? They're ready. All right. These guys are ready. I'm gonna cover this back up here so we don't get too big of a fire. You know, for a Florida State fan, you really are a pretty good cook. <laughs> Thanks, buddy. So now, 
you could do anything you really want to your wings. What I like to do is I like, I like to garnish my wings personally. The first thing that I'm gonna do is that I may know a little bit something about uh, this Buffalo Wild Wing sauce, but I love this Asian Zing sauce. I actually sometimes can mix the medium and the Asian Zing together, but the Asian Zing just seems like it's perfect on this particular thing. Now, and then I like to garnish them, like I said. So some things that I like to garnish with is, I like, I like the flavor of chives. So I put chives on there for sure. I like pickles, because pickles seem like a no-brainer to me. Now I have these other little pickles. These are actually a little pepper. They're not that spicy, but they're, they're cute. They're a little teardrop pepper. They're sweet. They're kind of like a and b version of bread and butter pepper, if you will. And then of course I have uh, some delicious carrots. I also, for sure, will serve it with some blue cheese dip as well. And then you also have a great dip and fun little garnishes on there. Very simple dish. What do you think, man? Dave, I think you've created the perfect tailgate meal right here. All right, it's wings and blue cheese and garnishes, but it's kind of, you know, elevated a little bit. Absolutely, it's absolutely gorgeous. And we have a shandy here. So cheers, it's football season in Atlanta. Go Knowles. Yeah, go Knowles, go Louisville, okay, go Cardinals. Right. Thank you. So uh, I'm gonna try one of yeah, these let's right try, now. Yeah, let's try these out. Okay. I'd like to know what you think. I think that one looks perfect. <laughs> Dig it in. Oh my god, that is absolutely right. amazing. Let me. Uh, oh, let me... it's got a good spice to it. Good crunch on the outside. Okay, perfect tailgate meal right here. All right, Thanks, all. Dave. Thanks, buddy. Cheers. <laughs> <laughs>